Yay, a response video. So, right now on TikTok, there is all those furry drama bringing up again. And guess who is starting to talk about me after a few months, like after literally a half year of drama? Looks like I'm gonna do a response video of Dragora Thunder talking shit about me. And why on YouTube? Because TikTok only can accept one minute straight. And I feel like this is gonna be a long video, so bear with me. Since a lot of people have been getting it mixed up, let me just clear the air because it's been getting on my last fucking nerve. Sorry if it's dark, by the way. So this girl, Standby Raptor, and her boyfriend, who's black and white character, I don't know, have been on my ass since the Blitz thing. Nice that you assumed that this drama started because of a fangirl. Back then, I was trying to be supportive. I even made fun of her myself. And my boyfriend was also joking around that if his persona isn't good enough for her, over Acreus. And were Acreus's friends, but I don't think they're friends. That's also wrong. My boyfriend had seen him as an idol back then. Also, I hate Acreus as well. But those are different reasons compared to you. But her and her BF are still after me and are not over the fact that I quote unquote cheated. Things happen. It quote unquote. You cheated on Acreus the first two times with your ex, letting him manipulate you. You should have called the police, but now you have to get all over your ex. That's also cheating, by the way. And the third time, you sent Acreus' friends nudes instead of just blocking them. Acreus' friends didn't try to be toxic. He wanted to prove that you didn't change. Besides, you still didn't change yet. I heard that you cheated on Mogi. And you had the same excuse, like the same apology. The same apology as you broke up with Arceus. That it just didn't work out. No, you cheated multiple times. It's my personal life, not yours. Why do you have to worry about it? Well. Originally, I don't want to let someone who cheats get away with this. And that you're bringing up the drama out of nowhere is also very... I don't understand how you're so caught up in my own life you don't even worry about yours. Well, I'm second year of uh, my job trainee as a sausage and meat seller. Getting bullied by coworkers, especially by one who is a literal Karen. Getting fret by my boss... If I don't take therapists, then I'm gonna get fired. My coworkers are picking up on me. And the only nice ones are those from the cheese place. I have been tested for a semester or trimester. I don't remember anymore. Trust me, I'm taking care of my own life as well. Or at least I'm worried about. My boyfriend has family issues and he wants to move out. And we're both trying to get him a new job, so... Yeah, we're definitely worried about our own life. We just cannot stand cheaters like you, and we just cannot understand why people are supporting you. Like, I'm glad that I, I'm in your head 24-7, I guess. The fact is, you both just gotta let it go, and all you other people who just gotta let it go, because I... And let you get away from being a cheater. Like, you heard it, people. You heard it, the half of your fans, including my boyfriend. I didn't look up to you so, um, so much, so yeah. It's just ridiculous that you have to bring it all up again, and especially while the Stephen Deneff drama begins. And honestly, that time I knew I get called out for my stuff at November with those duets and stuff. But since then... I didn't even look at your page. I'm trying to do my own thing now. I let it go. That doesn't mean you have to ruin everybody else's parade and what they're doing. So whatever you think, please be quiet. If you want to talk to me about it, DM me. That's it. 
After all those comment section of Steven Deneft's old video and those duet chains, I clearly knew it doesn't work though. You haven't seen a slightest sight of your own mistake and yet you still don't. You just brought up this drama again. And it's been a half year since our last drama. You said we cannot move on, but you still cannot do it either. Why did you make this stupid video? Honestly, this is really the ridiculous. Oh, and if anyone has to come up to this... No, I don't want you to die. Those stupid duets I uploaded and deleted again doesn't mean anything. Of course, I hate you, but roleplay doesn't mean exactly death threats or harassment. It's kind of a shame that I had to delete it just because I honestly want my chance to get viral. You see, I like to post furry war stuff. And that idea that I, not a furry has to attack and not a furry because of some reasons. I thought it was something unique. Turns out I had cast drama. I realized the mistake and I deleted those videos. Just stop bringing it up again. Since our last drama, I didn't post it a single video out of fear that I get harassed again. Just please... Do what I'm doing right now and stop bringing it up. It's really annoying and it's just pissed me off. Have a nice day.